Can you tell us what you've been working on? Yeah, of course. So, uh, hi, everyone. I'm uh, really excited to be here today and, and privileged to uh, reveal the first powered clothing product from Seismic. Um, our team uh, in Menlo Park has, our, our amazing team in uh, Menlo Park has been working extremely hard um, to create something that uh, we believe will be truly impactful and really change people's lives. And we think about what we're doing um, by creating the first practical super suit, uh, but a super suit that really can be a part of your everyday life. And our, um, the capability that we've created to enable this is something that we're calling intelligent wearable strength. And so I've, I'm going to introduce a lot of terms to you as, as I'm describing our product. And intelligent wearable strength are uh, uh, robotic muscles that are outside of but aligned with your body uh, and can be programmed to provide strength when you need it. Uh, our first uh, product will be powered clothing for core wellness. So we've created intelligent wearable strength that addresses the lower back uh, and the hips with the objective of improving quality of life by improving mobility. Uh, you can think about our suit in terms of three different layers. There's a base layer, uh, and there is a strength layer, and there is an intelligent layer. But really, the best way to understand it is for me to show it to you. So uh, let me, I have a few friends here today to, to help me do that. So I'm going to ask Bob to come and join me on stage. This guy looks familiar. Yeah, yeah, this is awesome. So, um, so the first thing I'd like to point out about the product that is, it is designed uh, as an undergarment, as a base layer. So, uh, if you are want to be discreet about the uh, wearable strength uh, that you have, you can do that. But we've also designed it um, around a premium uh, sport performance uh, design approach. And uh, if you want, you can wear this just like uh, any kind of active wear. You can wear this to the gym. Um, it can be be a regular part of your day. You can come on stage uh, at a conference. Yes, you, yes, yes. Yeah. You definitely, um, uh, someday we'll all be wearing it for sure. And uh, the thing that there are two uh, uh, features of this base layer. Uh, the first is that it uh, anatomically aligns uh, the muscles in the suit to your body. And so um, this suit is speci uh, specifically designed for Bob. And our designers, when they're, when they're fitting you, they're going to you know, have their tape measure around their neck. And, and they'll be uh, measuring uh, your inseam but they also understand your neuromuscular structure and uh, we're going and taking measurements that align exactly um, the muscles exactly to uh, your motions. And then the second uh, feature is the, uh, that it aligns those muscles to your body and, and we do that through a couple of uh, features here, just pointing out um, this gripping structure around the waist and then there's another gripping structure here uh, at the thigh, and the muscles actually extend. You can't see them, but they extend um, from uh, this muscle pack here into the uh, into the gripping structure at the waist. So, so um, the muscle system here is part of the strength layer, and so I'll I'll uh, describe that as well. So, thank you, Bob, and I'd like to ask Allison to please come out. So I mentioned earlier that we are addressing core wellness, and uh, we're, uh, we've replicated three different muscle groups in the product. Uh, these are aligned around the core, so the hip extensors. I always get this wrong, so it's uh, just like your arm flexion and extension. So we flex and we extend. So our hip extensors, the gluteus maximus, gluteus medius, um, the hips, hip flexors, um, and as well as then the, the back extensors, the lower lumbar uh, muscles. Um, the, uh, if you can turn to the right, then we're showing that in here is the, uh, the muscle structure as I described before. This is a, a pack that can be removed from the body, uh, can be removed from the garment. The batteries are here in the center and all the electronics are here in the center um, and that can be uh, charged separately. And then the garment layer is left that can be taken off and cleaned. And this is something that can be worn um, every day, all day, eight hours. Um, the battery life is, is uh, designed for eight hours of activity. 
And then as I was describing earlier, the muscles extend. Here's, uh, here the hip extensors extend up um, from this motor system here. So this is the power um, that drives the muscles. Um, and they contract just like uh, our normal muscles. And uh, while the uh, suit is listening to your body, they automatically turn on um, and support you um, based on the, on the control. So um, the control itself the includes, the, the suit also includes a range of sensors. In the, um, in the uh, packs here, the muscles each have their own force sensor, and there's a uh, nine axis IMU in each of the, of the muscle packs. And then on the back, there's an additional um, IMU, and also a, a host processor. So this is a fully independent platform. Um, all, it doesn't need any other kind of device to operate, and we actually consider all other devices as accessories to, uh, to the product. But the brains of the system really exist in this lumbar patch, as well as uh, additional um, muscles. We also have uh, full wireless uh, communication capability. Um, and that, that allows us to use the, the sensors uh, um, for lots of different applications, although the first uh, use is for the control of the system. So, and that's part of the intelligent layer. So I'll, I'll move on to that now. Thank you, Allison. So it's always um, doing demos with children, pets, and robots. So we're actually going to go live here. And I've done this a lot in my career. And we've had 100% success. But what I'd uh, like to be able to do is show you inside of the suit. So you left the babies and pets at home? What's that? Yes. <laughs> There, it goes. there we go. Okay, so we can show the dashboard. So we've created a dashboard um, that is uh, communicating to the suit. And you can see it here. And so um, right now, uh, this, this suit is streaming data, data to the dashboard. And uh, Tierney is showing just how the activity tracker is changing um, with her motion. And you'll see on the right, we're just looking at some posture um, tracking. Um, she's moving. If she sort of stands still, you'll see it um, move to the standing position. Let's see if you can get it to stand. And there it goes. And then on the left, we're showing the forces coming from the muscles. So on the far left is the muscles coming from the extensor, or the forces coming from the extensors. On the right are the uh, muscles coming from, the forces coming from the muscles on the front. And in the middle are the forces coming from the lumbar spine. So when she came out, uh, the lumbar uh, muscle was already activated. So the, uh, the first uh, purpose of our, uh, the sensors on the suit are to control it. And uh, we have a uh, user experience that we call symbiosis. And symbiosis means that the suit is always paying attention to what the person is doing and automatically turns on uh, when you need that, that strength support. And it's very similar to our own nervous system. Right now, my, my heart is beating a little bit faster. Or my my uh, uh, lungs are breathing a little bit deeper. But that's happening all on its own. Um, we want the suit to act the same way. And the, the, your muscle tone is actually being set by that same nervous system. So what I'd like to do is um, show just a simple example. So Tierney would sit down. Um, one of the key uh, and, uh, features of the suit is having enough power to assist with standing up um, with hip extension kinds of activities. You can see the suit recognizes she's um, sitting in, in a relaxed uh, manner. And then if she sits into a position where she's about ready to stand, so, so the suit actually just set the base tone. It just got ready to support her. And then now as she stands, it will turn on. And you'll notice the forces on the left, the forces in the extensors actually increased and supported her. And that's exactly what your glutes are doing when you're standing up out of a chair. So we've coordinated this um, with, with her motion. And then as she's standing, the suit is recognizing her standing and automatically and increasing the, the co-contraction, the, the, both of the forces in the flexors um, and and the extensors to give her support. And this is sort of like, you know, when you're, you're on a boat or a bus and it's, everything's moving and you're, you're holding yourself, that's, what, um, that's what's happening here. So, um, so that's the intelligent layer. And uh, I'd like to move on to one more uh, point about the suit. Thank you, Tierney. <laughs> so,
So just to point out also, uh, um, so Cody is wearing a, a, uh, you know, the same uh, clothing that uh, the rest of our models are wearing. And one of the big insights for us when we uh, uh, first spun out, and one of the things that's really driving the company right now, is that we had this insight that um, like nobody in this room is wearing robots. And I used to say that, and there's actually people in this room wearing robots now, um, but there were um, no one wearing robots, and we really understood that our, our objective was to bring new functionality to clothing while re uh, maintaining people's relationship with clothing in terms of comfort and aesthetic and emotion. And, and so Seismic as a company really is branded around that objective. It's really um, has, has uh, created our positioning and everything that we're doing is, is about th uh, thinking and acting like an apparel company. And we actually see what we've designed as um, sport performance activewear. Uh, when we've gone through our beta testing, our, our users are out playing golf in it and playing tennis in it. Um, they're, they're cleaning their house in it, but they're also sitting, sitting in it for a long time and getting some back support after their their back gets tired. So um, we're really excited about this positioning and also the reaction we're getting from the, the first uh, consumers of the suit. And then you'll also notice as I've been introducing the suit is the colors. Uh, and so what I'd like to highlight is that what we've been showing you here are um, the colors that represent our spring 2019 um, collection. So I'd just like to finish by presenting our uh, 2019 powered clothing collection from Seismic. Woo! 